What's going on guys, if you're new here, my name is Jaco and today guys I'm back here with another video showing you some tips how to get more cinematic shots with this aircraft like this one. Let's move to the video intro. So before this video starts guys, I want to ask you if you enjoyed this video to go and smash that like button. Also if you see my beautiful face in front of your screens for the first time, make sure to go and click that subscribe button to get notified when I upload future videos and don't miss them. Links for the social will be down in the description so you can go and check them out and follow me because I need followers. Also one important thing guys that I have another Instagram page which is only for photo stuff and uh, you can go and uh, leave one follower please do it for me and without any further ado let's just move to the actual video so guys the first tip which I'm gonna tell you right now is to film at the right time because in nowadays uh, drone sensors aren't good and uh, their dynamic range is so bad and make sure to film at the right time and you will see that you're Strong footage will be amazing. And what's the right time? I would say sunrise or sunset. So guys, tip number two is to not control your drone like this. I saw in a lot of people videos that they are doing this big mistake and you cannot get a cinematic shot like this one. I mean, no, you, you cannot do this, so hold your controller, you, you need to be like super calm and chill when you hold this and uh, you, you just do it like this and, and you will see the cinematic shot and you will see that there is a much better than dog this. Guys, the third tip which I can give you is to use uh, and the filters for your camera. This is like a sunglasses for your camera and uh, helps you to get the perfect motion blur of the shot which you wanna get and it's really amazing. Tip number four guys is to set the controller, not the controller, your aircraft to shoot on cinematic mode and that uh, like changing the speed of the drone and it goes super slow and uh, it changes also I think the shutter speed and the, the settings and helps you to like get a perfect nice shot and uh, it's, it's, it's a bit plus for uh, your shots and uh, your footage and everything which you are showing and go and do that thing if you want to shoot a B-roll so yeah so guys tip number five is to use slow movements like forward and backward and at the same time you're like you're doing backward but you're pulling your drone like this and it's going like that or like this or also rotating it on your subject so yeah guys these are my tips for today's video and i hope uh, you like them and enjoy them and i help you in some ways and if that's the case you can go and leave a like also if you see my face on your screen for the first time make sure to go and click that subscribe button to get notified when i upload future videos turn your post notifications also links for the social will be down in the description and somewhere here on the screen my channel page with uh, the photo stuff in Instagram you can go and check it out and follow me if you want and keep smiling keep dumbing on them haters and I'll see you next time guys peace